Hey guys, this is David. Just wanted to shoot a little video showing off something different today. A little bit of Galt, where I live now, and a little bit of my grandpa's old Benrus three star watch, which I just got repaired. So it's just about 7 p.m. here in Galt. I'm in this little park overlooking the city. You can see kind of some of the church steeples here and here. Really beautiful city. It's kind of overlooking this whole Grand River Valley here in southern Ontario. So a couple of years ago I inherited my grandfather's old Ben Russ three-star self-winding watch. He was a Alaska pioneer, went up to Alaska way before statehood, flying bush planes, flew for Wien Airlines. He was one of the one of the main guys at Wien actually. Um, so long time Alaska history. He flew cargo planes over to China from the Aleutians during the Second World War. And at some point, he got a Benrus three-star self-winding watch. And uh, from the wear marks around the band, he wore this thing all the time. It was very well, well used and well loved. And these were popular among airmen because, well, they were self-winding. So if you had to go on a really long flight and you wanted to keep time, you didn't need to remember to wind the thing. It winds itself while you move around. Anyway, when I got it, it was uh, it was in heavily used condition, so it needed a polish. The the crystal, which is this, you know, the clear glass over the front, basically, it was cracked, and scratched pretty bad, and um, it didn't run consistently. So I sent it off to to this guy, Cleveland Watch Repair, Randall Zadar, and uh, I corresponded with him via email a little bit before I sent this to him. He specializes in in kind of old watches, Benrus three stars, he does a bunch of. He said, yeah, send it on in, you know, it'll cost about this much. Um, if anything weird is going on, I'll let you know. And uh, we'll take a look at it. So I sent it in, he took it apart, sent me an estimate, gave me a uh, like a lead time on it, I think it was like 12 weeks, something like that. And when he, uh, when he got around to it, he sent me pictures of all the process, which was really cool taking all the action out, all the gears, all the, all the movement and everything, cleaning all of it, and then, uh, and then sent it right back to me in absolutely gorgeous condition. Really, really cool. And holds time amazingly well now. Pretty reasonable to, uh, to get it fixed. And it has, you know, like all these, like an old watch or anything, heirloom, you know, there's a story that goes with it. It's more than just an item. And so it was very cool to find somebody who could clean that thing up and put it back in service so easily. So if you have something similar, if you have a, a similar vintage watch that you want to get fixed and get running again, you know, to carry around as a as part of a story, part of your story, you know, part of your family, um, give Randall an email here and he will hook you up. Very excellent service. So thank you, Randall.